everybody, this is the Junk Man, and we're talking today about the Junk Man's world. Today, I'm going to have a few little uh, deals, and uh, I want to talk about something that uh, I've had this happen to me so many times. And, you know, you go out, and you're like, you're out metal detecting, and you're so involved that the, the whole area and everything, you're going, oh man, I'm having the greatest time in the world. And you're going down through there, and all of a sudden, where is my, where is my pen pointer? Or, hey, the worst one is, is my shovel. And I don't know how many times I've lost pen pointers and shovels because I couldn't find them. I'm never going to lose these things anymore. It's just a simple color to put that out there. When you're out in a cornfield or even some of the woods that I get into, I can't some days, I think my eyes, and I don't know, maybe I, I have to get my eyes on and say, oh, where the heck is that thing? So think about that next time you're out there and I've seen that happen a lot of times. Anyway, uh, the other thing we're going to talk about, um, you know, uh, cleaning fines. And, you know, you can have 50 people or 100 people tell you how many different ways to do it. You know, large cents, uh, wheat pennies, uh, Indians. You, some of them, you can damage them so quick by basically putting water on it. Don't put water on it. That, that is the worst thing, and that's my opinion. Don't use water. Virgin oil is, is a really good thing to do, and that's when you get back, back home. But right now, I want to show you that I always have these little tooth uh, picks. And you can take this tooth pick, you can put 10 of them in your, your pouch, and and, and when you're sitting there going over, and I can kind of show you because I'm cleaning uh, an item here. And basically when you have the dirt and stuff, you just go over it real light. You usually start out with your fingers and just brush off those mud and stuff. And why it's kind of almost drying up, you just kind of go over it real, real light. And, and then that'll, that'll save this coin a lot easier. But this one, never, never touch it with water. Put it in, put it in a little uh, deal like virgin oil. Let it kind of, you know, two or three days. Let it go, and then kind of clean this it up. This is a really, really cool little uh, Lincoln, and I think this one's an old one. Clean those things up. Be careful. You know, get out there and listen. To, uh, some of the other people that know about oils and stuff and be really careful what you do because you can ruin a, you know, a coin that is so expensive because you decide you want to clean it. I'm so blessed to be alive and get to do the hobby that I love so much and that's metal detecting. Josh Kimmel, what a great guy he is. He, he, he got me... Uh, on his show, and I know I rumble around and everything, but one of the things, he's a great guy. And, you know, uh, metal detecting beyond uh, sight and sound. He, he sent me a beautiful t-shirt, which I'll wear proudly because, you know, metal detecting is a family event and having fun, and that's what the hobby is all about. What I'm looking to do is the Civil War show in Mansfield, Ohio. I'm going to be up there. I'm going to have my dais outfit out. I'm going to be talking to people that I know, and if you if you see me out there, you know, come over to the, the uh, show and, and check it out. It's probably the funnest uh, event in Ohio, in my opinion, you want to go to Civil War show and you want to bring the kids and have a great time, check that out. And it's the Civil War show in Mansfield, Ohio. From the Junk Man's World, we'll talk to you later.